If you're considering making your career move to Canada, obtaining a work visa is an essential step. In this video, we'll break down the process of getting a Canadian work visa into clear and manageable steps. Step 1. Determine your eligibility. Before you start the application process, it's crucial to determine your eligibility for a Canadian work visa. There are several types of work visas available, such as the Temporary Foreign Worker Program (TFWP) and the International Mobility Program (IMP). Your eligibility will depend on factors like your job offer, qualifications, and the specific program you're applying for. Step 2. Secure a job offer. To apply for a Canadian work visa, you generally need a job offer from a Canadian employer. This offer must come in the form of a formal employment letter, detailing your job position, responsibilities, salary, and other relevant information. The employer may also need to provide a Labor Market Impact Assessment LMIA, in certain cases to prove that hiring a foreign worker won't negatively impact the Canadian job market. Step 3. Determine the Work Visa Category. As mentioned earlier, there are different categories of work visas based on the type of job, your qualifications, and the employer's circumstances. These include 1. Temporary Work Permits for short-term employment, usually up to two years. 2. Open work permits, allowing you to work for any Canadian employer, usually in cases like spousal sponsorships. 3. LMIA exempt work permits. If your job offer falls under a specific category outlined in the International Mobility Program. Step 4. Gather required documents. Depending on your situation and the specific visa category, you'll need to gather a set of required documents. These often include 1. Passport and passport-sized photographs 2. Valid job offer letter 3. Proof of educational qualifications and work experience 4. Language proficiency test results, usually English or French 5. Proof of sufficient funds to support yourself and any accompanying family members. 6. Medical exam results, if required. Step 5. Apply online. Most Canadian work visa applications are submitted online through the Immigration, Refugees, and Citizenship Canada IRCC, website. Create an online account, complete the relevant forms, and upload the required documents. Pay the application fee which varies depending on the type of work permit you're applying for. Step 6. Biometrics and Interviews Depending on your nationality, you might need to provide biometric information, fingerprints and photograph, at a local application center. Some applicants might also be asked to attend an interview at the Canadian consulate or embassy in their home country. Step 7. Wait for Processing after submitting your application, the processing time can vary. You can check the IRCC website for estimated processing times based on your location and visa category. During this time, it's essential to monitor your online account for any updates or requests for additional information. Step 8. Receive a Port of Entry PO, letter. If your work visa application is approved, you'll receive a Port of Entry PO, letter. This letter will outline the conditions of your work permit and provide instructions on entering Canada. Step 9. Arriving in Canada. Upon arriving in Canada, you'll be met by a border services officer who will assess your documents and grant you entry. Make sure to have all your relevant documents on hand, including your passport, PO letter, and work permit. Step 10. Settling in. Congratulations! you've successfully obtained a Canadian work visa. Now it's time to settle into your new job and life in Canada. Make sure to adhere to the terms and conditions of your work permit, and if you plan to stay longer, consider exploring options for permanent residency. Remember, navigating the Canadian work visa process can be complex and time-consuming. It's advisable to seek professional assistance if you're unsure about any aspect of the application. With careful preparation and attention to detail, you can make your dream of working in Canada a reality. Thanks for watching. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe.